I love authentic Mexican food. Mm-hmm. So I'm always excited when I hear people talking about their amazing food finds. In this video, we're going to check out a restaurant located on a relatively quiet street in Isla Mujeres, Mexico, rated number one on popular review sites. That place is Los Tacos de Yumo. The name of your restaurant, Oscar? Uh, tacos de Yumo. And this, these are the best tacos on Isla Mujeres. That's what uh, everybody says, and uh, I guarantee you, this, uh, you, you will have a good experience. Okay. okay. Well, let me explain a little bit about the, about the menu. Right here we have two guacamoles. Different between these two is the second one. It has a uh, mango and chipotle sauce. Okay. okay. The first one is just a traditional guacamole made with avocado, cilantro, onions. Okay. And then. On the five different tacos we have, they all come in three, three okay. tacos per order, and it comes with a double tortilla. Okay. okay. Uh, and then we have our Mexican style lasagna, which is amazing. Okay. And I would say the tacos that sell the most, I th- I also think that are really really good are the tacos locos, which is a combination of three meats. Uh, basically, it's uh, carnitas, um, chorizo. And steak. Oh, that sounds okay. good. Yeah. And a little bit spicy, by the way. And also, we have the shrimp tacos, which are also excellent. They're served on a bed of uh, cold smoke mixed in with chipotle aioli sauce. Okay. okay. Also, tiny bit uh, spicy. And that's about it. Okay. So, take a look at it. If you have any questions, let me know. That's it. So, Kelly, are you excited to try out the best tacos in Isla? Sure. Uh, I know I am excited. We got the Mexican lasagna and we got the refried beans. Callie just ate some of the tortilla shells. So with the refried beans. Really good. Now what's this look like inside? Oh look at that. Mm-hmm. Looks yummy. It does look yummy. Okay, mine. We've got the, I just ate the uh, pork rind off the top, but that's what they look like when it came. It looks good, it smells really good. Looks yummy. All right, Callie, give her a bite. No hot sauce for you? No, you're the hot guy. <laughs> oh, baby. We're the hot ones, actually. Oh, thanks, sweetie. Mm. Wow, what do you think? Really good? Definitely. Oh, yummy. Okay. Delicious. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, you didn't get some of this. Yeah. Yeah. Can you take this? Not yet. Mm. This one, is it? Very good. Very good. Perfect. So they surprised us with a complimentary churro donut, and Callie couldn't wait to dig into it. So she hasn't taken a bite yet, but she's she's ready to go. Oh my goodness. How is it's it? warm and sweet, just like a fresh bakery donut with lots of sugar. Nice and soft? Oh yeah. yeah. Is this going to raise my blood sugar? I don't raise anyone's blood sugar. <laughs> you know what? I better start, I better get a bite before you eat it. Because That's true. Here, I'm going to try and get some of this ice. That's yummy. Oh. Mm. That's, that's good. This is going to be a race to the finish. Mm. <laughs> We're like pork fighting. So we just finished eating at, pronounce it for me. Uh, I feel bad. I, I wish I could pronounce this. Kelly. It looks like Los Tacos de... Um, Los Tacos del Humo? No. I, we're terrible. How do you pronounce the name of the restaurant again? Tacos de Humo. Oh, gosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what was your name? Jimena. Very nice to And this place was fantastic. Thank you so the much. The food was Thank great. You. So, yeah, there you have it. Los Tacos de Humo. Los Tacos del Humo. No, Los, Humo. Humo. Los Tacos <laughs> del Humo. You know what? Regardless of the fact that we can't pronounce the name, we could sure taste the food. And oh, oh my gosh. It was very yummy. Um, oh. When they say that this is rated five stars on uh, Yelp and everybody raves about it, um, you know, I'm, I'm a part of a couple of different uh, Isla Mijeras mm-hmm. uh, Facebook groups. And when it comes to best tacos, this place comes up uh, often. 
and it was hard to get to uh, for parking. If you're walking, it's not so bad. Yes. But we were renting the golf cart, and so it was a little bit harder to get to. Yes. Anyways, so um, we give it. I I give it five stars. Five star for sure. Definitely five yeah. stars. So it, when you're in for Isla, cheap eats, it's not that. I no. mean. Well, it cost I mean, us probably pesos about, for, you know, $12 for tacos, Canadian yeah. for a meal, which yeah. is average, like, McDonald's food, really. But it was full sit-down but service it, and yeah, the food was... and it was delicious. Way better yeah. than oh, my goodness. <laughs> and, like, if you're watching this from yeah. the States or from Canada, and yeah. you're thinking Taco Bell, you're going to pay that much at Taco Bell. Yeah, and, and, it's and you're going to get filling. Nothing against Taco Bell, if you're mm -hmm. watching, but um, this is... There's no yeah. There's no comparison. Like, this yeah. is is uh, really really good food and it was worth every penny that we paid for it yeah and the service Small, was great place, but yeah. it's nice. and even the the local dog that kind of wandered in there i don't <laughs> think he belonged there because they, they looked like they were trying there. to get him out. She's like, she, oh yeah there she is i i tell you like store. i mean she wasn't big in her Sweet she went in there girl. and she would sit hoping somebody would give her something but yeah very you know, more, well more you know more behaved than our own dogs yeah i mean this is mexico right like a lot of the places are open and she looks like she's been fed, like she doesn't look like a really hungry dog, but so well behaved, you know, she just, she would go and if she came close to your table, she would sit. And if you didn't give her anything, she would find another table to sit at, <laughs> like just sit, not beg, not yelp, yeah, not cry. Foot, yeah. And uh, and then just, just work yeah. away. So Kelly had a craving for uh, tacos de humo again. Mm -hmm. And uh, in trying to find it, we stumbled across tacos de humo but it's not the same location we were in there a couple of days ago. So apparently they have uh, three different locations, same food, which is fantastic. So we're gonna be uh, eating here. All right, so we just had another great meal at Tacos de Humo. And this time we both had the uh, Mexican lasagna because it is just so good. Let us know what you think. Have you been here? Let us know what your experience was. Let us know what your favorite dish was. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and ding that bell. And we're gonna do more food tour videos as we go along throughout the next week here in Isla. I better get a bite before you eat it. That's true. You're, you're not really waiting. I'm not anything for you. See, I've already got so much gone already. Yeah, I've eaten a third of it. <laughs> it's tacos del humo? No, it's not hue, it's a J. That's a J. So Why would be a J? Because H is pronounced with a J, no, right? No, J is pronounced H. So how is H pronounced? Ah. Is it a W? Uma. Uma? Uma? I Uma? think it's the other way around. Uma? Tacos de, no, these jalapenos are a J and they're pronounced with an H. Jalapeno. <laughs> Tacos de Uma. Uma? Is it an H? Is it a Uma? Uma. 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 You don't pronounce the H. H. Oh. It's oh, silent. Uma. 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 Uh, okay. Uma. Umo. Tacos de Umo. She hasn't taken a bite yet, but she's, she's ready to go. And uh, although she's ready to go, but she's distracted also with with uh, the pretty little dog that also knows that we have a churro donut. And I, mm, I love puppies. Okay, so try out the churro donut. What do you think? Hold on, I'm still looking at the cup. She's so cute.